Hello students this question is from the topic introduction to factorization the question says is it true that the factored form of p square p square plus 30p plus 216 is this one p plus 18 into p minus 12 so how we will do it so we need to factorize this if the answer comes p plus 18 into p minus 12 so the answer will be true otherwise the answer will be false so let us solve so you have now how will you factorize it that is the main task so now i teach you so first of all you have to think of two numbers which two numbers so see two numbers a and b whose addition gives you the middle number that is whose addition gives you 30p and two numbers also whose multiplication gives you the multiplication of these two numbers that is 216 into 1 and that is equal to 216 p square right so you have to think of two numbers which gives 30p on adding and 216 p square on multiplication so the two numbers are what let us check that if the two numbers are 18 and 12 so if you multiply 18 into 12 so yes they gives us what 216 so and if you add them then also they give 30 so we can take these two numbers these two numbers right that are a and b So students, we have eighteen and twelve as the two numbers. So you will get the what p square plus. So you can split the middle term. This is called middle term splitting. Middle term splitting. Middle term splitting because in this case you generally split the middle term. So yes, you have the what. Thirty p is equal to what eighteen p plus twelve p. Now you see eighteen plus twelve is thirty also, and the multiplication also gives us what two hundred and sixteen also, right? So this plus two hundred sixteen. Now students, this is equals to you have to take common, right? When you will take common, so then you will have. The final answer, if it is true or not, so you can take. P is common, so P and then P plus eighteen, right? And here you can take twelve as common, so plus twelve and P plus eighteen, right? Here you will get P plus eighteen. So now you do what? You have P plus eighteen, P plus eighteen here. Then you can write it like this. This is equals to P plus eighteen. And p plus twelve, p plus twelve. So this is your final answer. Yes. And does it match with the question, the answer which is given in question? No. That is here you will have plus sign, but in question it is minus. So the answer is what false. The factored form of this is not this. right it is not this so the answer is false and i hope you have understood at how we did the factorization part right thank you students